Good morning and welcome back to Stardew Valley and of course to Dapper Del Farm where it is the 25th of spring, Pierre's birthday tomorrow. Now, ooh, a new episode of Living Off the Land. I'd like to talk about the famous adventurers guild near Pelican Town. The guild leader, leader, Marlon, has a nice reward program for anyone brave enough to slay monsters in the local caves. Adventurers will receive powerful items in exchange for slaying large quantities of monsters. There's a poster on the wall with more details. Very cool. Now let's have a look. In good humor, that's uh, very nice. And the weather report tomorrow's. Oh, rain all day tomorrow. Very well. That is not as useful a thing as it used to be. Pickled cauliflower is worth a lot, it appears. Wonderful. Uh, is there anything I want to drop off? No, not particularly. Okay, moving on. Now, what I can do is I can pop you down over here, can't I? Bomp. Right there. Hello. Dear Avak, here's a vegetable from the little garden I keep out back. You probably have more veggies than you know what to do with, but oh well. Oh, Caroline, that's really sweet of you. She's such a kind person. Right, well, we want to sell all of this pickled cabbage, I fancy. Whoosh. We'll keep that cauliflower because we can always use it to in the preserve jars we're about to lay down. Anything? No, 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 yes. Thank you. These can all go into the new preserve jars, or rather the old preserve jars that are now going to be placed somewhere else. Uh, broken fences everywhere. Right then, preserve jars. Let's get all of these down. There we go. Uh, strawberries first. Ah, oh, damn it. Know what I meant to do. You know what? Cherry too as well. Oh, I've already done everything there. Fair enough. Alright, let us grab a little bit of everything from down here. We will place the trash straight into the recyclers. There we go. Grab the cheese, grab the mayo. Pop some duck eggs into the mayo machines. There we go. Not bad. Do we have any extra milk? We do not, that's fine. Okay, well, everything seems to be going well. I could cut some more grass. In fact, I think I will. There we go. Might as well get as much of this as we can. Start filling up the silos ready for winter. On that note, probably going to go and talk to Robin again about getting a new silo, I think, today. Hello, everyone. Oh, you're no longer a baby. You're really happy today. Looks fine. Looks fine. Very well. Some milk. Some milk from you. Some goat's milk. And... Why are we going to get large milks, I wonder? I'm actually very, very eager for that. Okay. You can all come out now. Enjoy. Right, off to see the chickens. Wow, so many eggs. Chickens and the uh, ducks, rather. There we go. Thank you. Why are you quacking? Makes no sense. There we are. Okay, everyone come out. We're all done now. Where's Snufkin? There you are, running into a wall, as usual. Silly Snufkin. Got any more room? We do. As long as there aren't three different types of mushrooms in here. There are not. There are no types of mushrooms in there. Very well. Okay, so we can go and drop off a load of our produce into the refrigerator. And then we can go and sell a bunch of the rest. I think we'll drop off a little bit more milk. So two of those go in there. Some extra cheese. Um, no, we're not going to be dropping off any strawberries. And some eggs. I think that is fine. The apron can go in there. The cherry can go in there. And everything else is good. Fantastic. We can go off and we can visit the... Um, actually, if we're going to be going that way, we may as well take this to give to Pierre. But we can visit the community center and finish off the Riverfish bundle, which I'm quite eager to do. 
go ahead and drop off some of these. We're going to go straight for the ghost mod first. There we go. And drop all of that off. And you're all waiting, so we'll need to wait on that a little bit longer. All right. I've got some business with Pierre, it seems. Oh, I'm going to have to repair these walls, too. I'm still deciding on whether I'm going to put a fence around the industrial area or not. I'm actually kind of leaning towards not at the moment, I'll be honest with you. There is definitely a fairly big part of me that's wondering that it might be nicer just to keep as is. Oh, actually, uh, you can go down somewhere. Where am I going to put you? I'll pop you there. There you go. Tally ho! Ooh, some more forage. Let's go and grab that while we're here. It's going to be hard for us to get the skill up for foraging otherwise. There we go. Now, if we head into Calico Desert, we'll take the daffodil with us. Give to Sandy. Let's check up here. Anyone around? Nope, no one's around up here. Oh, some more daffodils, though. Thank you. Oh, drat. I forgot to get the materials for the side. Oh, that isn't too much of an issue, though. Not right now, anyway. Stoink! There we go! Fantastic. Right, what do we get? We've only got two more bundles. One fish in each, really. Just 30 p. Wow. That hardly seems worth it. In any any sense. My lord. Don't want to be an ungrateful, but you get the amount of time and effort that it took me to get that. Right. I guess if I'd just been a better fisherman, it wouldn't have taken me that much time. But, oh well. Hey, Elliot. Here we go. Oh, let me just double check. It isn't your birthday or anything, is it? Nope. There we go. Here we are. Oh, no. Really? Scallywags, please let me... Oh, I was... Fine. Uh, really? Are we not chatting at the moment? This depresses me. Maybe I'll just get takeout from the saloon. Yeah, sure. Why not? In fact, actually, thinking about it, I've probably given most people two gifts already now, haven't I? Well, drat. Caroline, however. Caroline can have a gift. Here we go, Caroline. Oh, goodness, are you sure? Yes, I am. Oh, Abby's not talking to me either. Hey, Alec, you're my number one customer. Thank you. You know what? Have a daffodil. That's very kind of you. I like it. You're welcome. All right, I would like to sell my mayonnaise, my high-quality strawberries, and one of my wines. Also, this dandelion. There's nothing I want to buy at the moment, though, I'm afraid. Uh, flooring is quite nice, but I want something different. I am, however, going to buy a bouquet. Maybe I'll buy two. Right. Now, someone in the comment has mentioned a note on Pierre's fridge. Let's go and have a look. Is there a note on Pierre? Yes, there is. Can I have a read of this note? In any way? I don't think I can. It's loaded with fresh veggies. Ah. To Mr. Pierre, it pains me to be the bearer of bad news, but I feel obliged to inform you of a recent development most threatening to your livelihood. Joja Co. has decided to expand into Pelican Town. It's too late for protests. Joja builders have already broken ground for the new Joja Mart. This must be devastating news for you. So many years in business, a local standby and now obscured by the shadow of a powerful, efficient, economically viable corporation. What a shame! As manager of the new Jojo Mart, I feel, to some degree, personally responsible for your predicament. As such, I'd like to offer you a position as assistant grocer. Wages start at five gold an hour. I look forward to seeing your resume. <laughs> the Morris manager Pelican. Wow. Morris, that's even more harsh than the you showing up and giving everyone 50% off or 25% off, whatever it was you scoundrel you I had no idea, I mean I always knew you were evil but I mean that's like, that's Sith level evil you cats hey Evelyn I'll be baking cookies today, wonderful hello Jody uh, well I would give you one of these but you're weird and don't like them so I'll give you this instead Thank you, this makes my day really special. You're welcome. Hey, Sam. Well, my dad is back. Have you met him? Yes, I have. 
when will you stop asking me that silly question? Hey Emily, I hope you're farming in a sustainable way. The valley's ecosystem is fragile. I agree. Is your sister in? Hmm. No. I shall have to check back later. Uh, okay. Now, I've given Leah everything. Um, oh, actually, I've given Haley all the presents I can give her today. Penny, however, the double matter. Uh, George, I can give you something. Marnie, I can give something. Lewis, Shane, Pam. Oh, so many people. I guess I'll be swinging by the saloon later. Corbus. Let's go and say hello to Corbus. Hello. Hello, Corbus. I have an honorable gift for you. Such honor. You're welcome. Also, what are you selling today? Mixed seeds. Uh, not really my bag. Thank you very much, though. Okay, off we go. Now, given that it's 3 p.m., I could, I suppose. Hmm. I don't know. We could swing by the cave, I guess. Oh. This is where you were. Taking pictures of a sign. Of a house. Oh, you didn't take a picture of me! Oh, Alec. The lighting is so nice right now. I had to come out and take some na nature shots. Oh. I've been trying to connect with the outdoors a little more. I've noticed, actually. It's quite endearing. I want to know what it's like being a farmer. It's a way of life I've never really thought about. Well, until now. Oh, so cute. <laughs> These cows are so cute. Hey, have an idea. What is the idea? Let's take some pictures with the cows. You can show me how to approach one. I'll just set it to shoot on a timer. Very well. It's actually remarkably easy to approach a cow. You just walk towards it. Cows are incredibly accommodating creatures, actually. Oh, we're getting, like, snapshots. The cow looks happy. Uh, I'm not sure this is... I mean, you can ride a cow, but... Yep, that's what I thought was going to happen. Okay. Oh, dear God. Yeah. Oh, wow, okay. That's, that's, that's a better response than I thought was coming next. Okay. That was fun, Avak. And these photos are hilarious. Uh, yeah, actually, they, they were quite cute. I'm going to go home and take a shower now. Yeah, I... Yes. I, I think that's probably a wise idea. Oh, that was lovely. Akasha! You must go back. Hopefully she's finished with her shower now. I haven't actually seen that they have a bathroom. Um, hello? Oh. Okay, well, actually, just as... My lord, I just walked into the room knowing that she can't have a shower. Ah, uh, that was genuinely just me being clueless and not being a creep. I... Uh, that's probably whatever creep in the universe has ever said. Ah, uh, that feels bad. <sighs> hey, Leah. Foraging is a speciality of me. Someday I'll make you a fresh salad. Thank you. I can't give you any presents, or I would, but... Can I give Resmodius anything? I don't think I can. No, not today. Okay, well, let's go and grab ourselves... Ooh, some more horseradish. Uh, okay, we're not getting through there. Yoink. Let's go grab that. That was actually really, really cute. Haley's actually... developed as a character a lot. Since the start of the game. Or at least since the impression that she gave off at the start of the game. Probably I would say she's developed the most of all of the characters. All the others started in some way with very strong endearing points. But Haley had very few from the onset. But she's actually become quite sweet. Did someone just try to attack me? I'm not sure. 
go. A decent amount of hardwood. Yeah, there was something going on. You know what? You, got, you get a freebie today. I care not. I'm in too good of a mood. Um, hmm. Well, we could go and see... a lot of random stuff on us. If we go to the mines, we're probably not going to come out with very much. But it might be worth trying all the same. Is anyone in yet? There we are! Hey, Haley. Well, that was the dirtiest I've ever been. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Uh, Look, that was really, really sweet. I had a lot of fun. I'll accept this, thank you. <laughs> I'll accept this, yes. Have you been thinking about this? That was almost like Clint's response. That is to Emily, not to me. I haven't given Clint a bouquet off camera. We weren't practicing, okay? Even though he needs to practice. We, we may have gone over, look, okay? I might have helped him write a script. But there was no live action practicing of his pickup lines on Emily. Absolutely none. Maybe, maybe one. It stopped at a hug. My lord. <sighs> it's locked. Uh, oh well. Now then. We could go to the saloon, and we probably should. We can still give both Pam and Shane a gift today. <laughs> you two are so regular here, and that's such a sad thing. Uh, here you go. Hey, hey! Now this is really something! Thanks a million, kid! Hello. I've been looking forward to this beverage all afternoon. Did you know I was going to bring it to you? Like, what? Here you go, Shane. Oh, wow, Avak. How do you know this is my favourite? Because you've told me like three or four times. Bah. Where's the Jojo Cola? Uh, moving along. I'm going to try not to take offence. Trying really hard. Gus! Oh, goodness, are you sure? Yes, I am. Hey, you look like you could use a beverage. Do I? Oh, well. If you say so. No, the day the day's going far too well for me to risk ruining it. Uh, there we go. Hey, Clint. Business has been slow lately. Well, maybe you should use this as an excuse to go and uh, chat with Emily. Just just saying, you know, it could be an opening opening line. Not a very good one, but. You know, for you, it's, it's probably still something. At least you'd be talking to her, Clint. Just like we practiced. Go on. He can't hear me. I'm far too far away. We're having this conversation in my mind. But even in my mind, he refuses to go and talk to Emily. This is a bad thing. Let's go and see if Linus is around. Hello, Linus. Um, 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 uh, I have not got any food. Here you go, Linus. This is a great gift. Thank you. You're welcome, mate. People here seem nice, but they avoid me. Is it them avoiding you? Or are you avoiding them? Because I've started to wonder, Linus. I know you say that, that, that people throw things at you, but really, do they? Or do you just assume that they will? Troubling predicament, to be sure. Oh, big blue worms. I probably passed a few. Mixed seeds. Oh, that's not too bad. Uh, pow! Good enough. <sighs> I'm literally not doing anything. Lazy mode engaged. I look up. Always seem to catch you. 
Uh, there's no fish that I can catch right now that will actually help with bundles. I believe all of the ones that I need to catch are in other seasons or other um, weather. So rain, basically. So chirp. We'll get one more and then we'll go over and check out the quarry. Oh, okay, we'll go try one more besides that one, because seaweed doesn't count, nor does algae. This is probably a chub again. Ooh, this one is actually moving a little bit faster. Yeah. Okay, good enough. Uh, I did get two green algae. I suppose I can make something from that. Right, we got anything nice over here? What on earth are you? <gasps> Iridium ore. So that's what they look like. Very well, I will keep my uh, eyes out for that. Rocks with spirals on them. That was rather unexpected. I came here more or less just as a on a whim. I was like, oh, well, I may as well do something with the rest of my night. Right, well, there's no reason for us to stay out here in cash or for me to go back by the minecart and then you to trot home on your own. We'll ride home together. It'll be nice. It's a bonding time for us. It's you, me, the night sky, the crickets slash cicadas. I'm fairly certain these are crickets. Ooh, wiggly worms also. Clay. Can't forget the clay. Wild forage, perhaps? Uh, yes, actually. Horseradish. Fantastic. And another horseradish. With my foraging skill... That can quite often mean two. Okay, now, we need to be uh, swift about this. I need to lock all of the doors because it's going to be raining quite heavily tomorrow. There we go. Thank you. And the chicken coop as well. Fantastic. Today has been a good day. There you go, Kasha. Enjoy. Uh, do I want to drop things off? I do, kind of. Uh, so we'll drop these off. Honestly, those can go as well. Um, I'm pretty happy with everything else. Very happy with everything else, actually. Uh, we don't quite have enough. Ah, so close and yet so terribly far away. Ah, that is a bit of a disappointment, I must confess. I am a tad bit disappointed. Okay. Let's just go ahead and jump into bed. Right, it is Pierre's birthday today. Or rather, when I wake up. Oh, that wasn't bad. Wow. Okay, that is really nice. Two strawberries by themselves are a decent amount. Should have kept them, though. I should have turned them into something. Oh, well. We need a lot more coal, a lot more stone, a lot more wood. Right, there we go. And we've got another keg that we can move down to the industrial area. But that is going to be it for this episode. I hope you've enjoyed and will be joining me for the next, where we will find out what I can give Pierre. I'll probably bake him a chocolate cake, knowing me. But that will all be for the next episode. So as always, I look forward to any feedback you may have to offer. And a like on the video lets me know that you want to see more Stardew in the future. But until then, do take care.